Hello, welcome to another video walk around. My name is Christian. Today we're going to be looking at a 2016 Toyota 4Runner. This is a five passenger SUV in gray driving on 20 inch wheels. Some of the great exterior features on this 4Runner includes a hood deflector, parking sensors on the front and rear bumper, proximity smart key system and running boards. Helping us inside is our key fob here. It has our lock and unlock button. Like I mentioned, this 4Runner does have a smart key system so we can press these two lines on the door handle to lock the vehicle and to unlock it, it's as easy as putting our hand inside the door handle. Take a closer look inside. Right on top, you have your power windows and locks. You have some storage space in the bottom of the door here. You'll also find your memory seating presets in the center, along with your power mirrors next to the door. You also have your parking assist button here as well, where you can turn those sensors on and off. Now, if we take a look inside, you can see this 4Runner comes equipped with all weather mats, black leather seating. On the bottom, you'll find your power seating adjustment buttons. And on the top, you also have a power moonroof. We're going to start this 4Runner up by pushing the brake and then pressing the start button right behind the steering wheel there. Now as always, we're going to start with the steering wheel features first. On the left side, you have your audio controls. On the right side, you have your hands for calling and your voice recognition. You also have this display button which allows you to cycle through your multi-information display. And while we're up here, you can see in the odometer, this 4Runner has only 60,185 kilometers on it. Moving on to our display here, right now we are on the home screen where it will display any audio that's playing along with your navigation map on the other side. We can press that map and that will enlarge, you can set your destination. Now if we go into audio, you have your standard AM and FM options. You also have choices like CD, USB auxiliary, and you can always connect your phone through Bluetooth as well. Going into reverse, that'll bring up that backup camera for you. Moving down below that is the climate control. It is a dual zone, so the temperatures can be adjusted on both sides. You'll also find your AC button on the right side along with your heated mirrors button. Down below, we have some storage and cup holders. This is where you'll also find your USB and auxiliary, 12 volt outlet, and your driver and passenger heated and ventilated seats. Now inside the back here, we have some storage on the bottom of the door, just like the driver's side. Of course, we're continuing with the all weather mats and the black leather. Take a closer look inside here, behind the front passenger and driver's seat, you do have these little nets, for some extra storage, and these rear seats do also fold down. There's a little button here in the corner. If we give that a press, seats will fold, giving you access to your cargo. And to access the cargo from the outside, there's a little button underneath it for an emblem there. If we give that a press, that will open up nice and easy. You can see you do have plenty of storage space in the back here. Like I mentioned, those rear seats do fold down. That will always give you that extra bit of room. This runner also comes equipped with a cargo mat as well. You can protect that fabric underneath. If we take a look on the right side, you will also have a power outlet along with your 12 volt outlet. Taking a last look at our Forerunner once again, some of those great interior features includes your black leather, navigation, driver and passenger heated and ventilated seats, along with the power moonroof. There's still a lot more I didn't get a chance to show you, so why don't you come on down and take a Ford test drive. We're located here at Toyota Northwest Edmonton on the corner of 137th Avenue and Upper Trail. Thank you for watching this video. Walk around. My name is Christian, and as always, drive safe.